when you look at the numbers, you really appreciate the value of life. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top five causes of death in men that are way too common. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we're looking at the five leading causes of death in men and ranking them based on how prevalent they are. Number five, diabetes, urogenital, blood, and endocrine diseases. This umbrella of medical conditions on the rise in the US claims the lives of roughly 43 men per 100,000 each year. Though such diseases can affect people across the globe, the regions of the world where fatalities are highest include Mexico, where the rate skyrockets to 161 per 100,000, and parts of Central and South America, Africa, the Middle East, and Southeast Asia. In Fiji, the country where such deaths are at their highest, the number is closer to 350 per 100,000 each year. Apart from diabetes, the other common conditions in this category include kidney disease, hemoglobinopathies, hemolytic anemias, urinary diseases, and others. Number four, chronic respiratory diseases. There are many things humans are capable of living without, but oxygen is not one of them. And unfortunately, the respiratory system can play host to a wide variety of serious conditions. Globally speaking, 54 out of every 100,000 men will die per year of a disease of this type. What's perhaps most frustrating about the high death toll associated with these conditions is that the vast majority of the deaths are preventable if proper medical treatment is made available. As such, the incidence of death from chronic respiratory conditions is significantly higher in developing countries. Number three, diarrhea, lower respiratory, and other common infectious diseases. Diarrhea is something most Westerners think of as little more than an unpleasant but fleeting gastrointestinal experience. In at-risk populations, however, it can result in severe dehydration, and if left untreated, death. Individuals who are prone to diarrhea due to environmental factors, living conditions, and lack of access to proper medical treatment also have an increased risk of contracting lower respiratory infections. Of course, smoking can also contribute to lower respiratory problems, and of these, pneumonia is arguably the biggest killer. Add to that the common infectious diseases, like malaria, and you've got a substantial danger to the health of men, particularly in countries where potable drinking water is scarce. Number two, neoplasms, cancer. Don't let the name confuse you. A neoplasm simply refers to any anomalous growth or mass stemming from the abnormal division of cells. If the resulting tumor is benign, with the exception of a few very rare instances, it poses no threat to one's safety. If it's malignant, however, it's classified as cancer. Every year, 139 out of every 100,000 men around the world will lose their lives to cancer of one form or another. Unlike many of the other leading causes previously discussed, fatal cancer is far less discriminating. Lifestyle factors and medical care do play a role, but not nearly to the same degree as other causes of death. Number one, cardiovascular diseases. Of all the leading causes of death in men that are far too common in our times, this is the one that's most prevalent. In a substantial numerical leap from a runner-up entry, cardiovascular disease claims the lives of 249 per 100,000 men yearly. But thankfully, the number is in steady decline. Back in 2000, the fatality rate was much higher, at 320 per 100,000. Nonetheless, it remains the leading cause of death in men. Within this class of deadly conditions, ischemic heart disease is the leading killer, followed by strokes, with various other cardiovascular diseases each doing their part to achieve this grim statistic. The takeaway? Make heart-healthy choices.